I'm Vicky Dorico from Providence, Rhode Island. I'm ready to step in the ring. I'm sick of people calling me a ring girl and asking me to be a ring girl. It really pisses me off because some girls can fight. This is my competition. Come on, man. I need better than a cheerleader, man. I know I look like a cheerleader and I used to be a cheerleader, but now it's time to put the pom-poms down and put the gloves on. Vicky D, who the fuck are you? And here she comes. Here she comes. She had the biggest crew. She's got her Signed, own sponsors. Vicky. Vicky. Tierico. Yep. Look at how many sponsors she got. Vicky should probably have music. She looks very serious. Very serious. Well, maybe it's the Tyson thing. Back in the day, no music. Even scarier. Now, this guy fought who's holding the sign. Bam Yeah, bam. that's right. That is Bam Bam. Oh, yeah, so that's the whole thing. And they're undefeated. She's fighting for undefeated, right? They're holding she looks serious. All right. She looks like Ronda Rousey right now. Yeah, let's get to the next one. So we got the Bumblebee, Leanna Cruz. Vicky D'Errico. I do not know. I'm like very nervous for this fight. So am I. So am I. She's got her own gear. Now this girl, she's fighting a Dominican fighter. They don't like each other. She said, the Dominican fighter said, uh, it, what, Cruz, what's her name? Leanna Cruz. Bumblebee. Leanna Cruz, Cruz said, I've always wanted my own cheerleader. I'm gonna make her my bitch. Oh, yeah. yeah. And she was very, nice, very serious man. about that. That's not nice. Oh, I thought the Bumblebee was the cheerleader. No. No. All right, Leanna Cruz is the Bumblebee. Yes. Um, there she is. I mean, just by the look of these two girls. Yeah. Like they're professional girl fighters. Yes. And how progressive. And look us. at the look at this guy, showstopper yeah. boxing gym. The this Bumblebee is going to be something. I actually overheard her go up to her coach last night at the weigh-ins and say, there's another girl here that wants to fight me. Can we see if we could do two in one night? Oh, and yes. the fact that she was willing to do that scares the ever-living shit out of me. She also looks like it. she's been Vaselined up on the face. Yes, she has. Yes, she has. Smart. An old boxing trick there. Now, how do you think their feelings are? Nerves? What? We need some music. Right I think now? it's excitement. I think I think uh, when we when we uh, talk to the to Bumblebee before the fight, and her dad, her trainer, was like, "Hey, this is the fun part. We put yeah. in all the hard work. This yeah. is the fun part." And now the Vaseline's coming on. This is a real fight. This is a real fight. This is for real. The first main event, uh, female main event we've had in Rough and Rough. Do you think they're gonna be friendly after or no? We'll see how it goes. I yeah, think it we'll depends see. on how it goes. We'll see. No looks at each other right now. I'm curious to see what happens when they come out ringside. Bumblebee, 22 way. years old. Victoria, 19 and years old. And look at the crowd. Look at what they're fighting in front of. The adrenaline must be pumping through their veins. Yes. A lot of people are here for them. Yes, I know. Love it. Everyone's on their feet Everyone here. Everyone is excited for this fight. This is one of the coolest main event atmospheres we've ever had. And it's one of those fights I have no idea what to expect. None. 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 Muay Thai shorts on Bumblebee. I almost feel like this should be a 12 round fucking fight. <laughs> like they they're both Muay look like they're in know. fucking perfect shape. Yep. They're both moving in ways that make me think they're like pros. Loose, yeah. Are they going to touch gloves? Yep. Yep. Oh. oh. All right, we get one out of them. We get one out of them. That was a little dastardly. Yeah. And right, here, here we, we go. go. No idea what to expect. Coming right in, they're both swinging. Oh, this is what I expected. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I, all right, Victoria's, Victoria is no joke. I don't think either of them are joking. No, they're not. They're both just trading. A little oh, and they're shit talking talk. shit in the ring as well. He's this like, is incredible. This is everything we wanted it to be. Perfect opponents for each other. No back down. Get a hair problem. That happens. Get a hair problem. Ref Both fighters it. incredibly aggressive. Zero back down. That's what makes this great. Neither of them are afraid of each other. Both of them just swinging. This is all going to come down to who wants it more. I don't think Bumblebee was expecting this. Maybe after the weigh-in she was. No, and it's clear, too, that v Vicious Vicky can get right straight forward. Bumblebee's got to move around a little bit more. Vicky's going to just... Oh, good right throw there from Cruz. A straight left jab followed up by a right hook. That was very nice. Oh, yeah. See, Bumblebee's got a little more wiggle to her. Two of the more technically sound fighters we've seen all night, without a doubt. Without a doubt. Good first round. Who would you give that round to, round one? I think I'd give it to Vicky. Um, I would I would, I would, would lean Bumblebee Yeah, there. I would, too. I think Vicky had a nice start, but Bumblebee is able to move around a little bit more. 
that. And hit her a couple times where she didn't really see it coming. Very interesting that you'd be able to find in this small area, like two basic girls, same weight, same height, same intensity, same skill level, yep. sort of. Yep. Yeah. It's paying off as well. That first round was everything we wanted it to be. I'll tell you who would like drool over Bumblebee is like, I can never tell with girl boxers, like just how skilled they're both attract. Like she's like a marketing dream. Yes, yes, like, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. What, who is be, that little? She might be our rough or roundy, Ronda Rousey. Who like is the said, skinny uh, blonde girl? Paige in Van Zandt? Yeah, 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 yeah kind of yeah, has yeah. that kinda vibe. Has that vibe? Yes. The colored hair, the cool look. Round two. Anybody's fight. Everyone's standing. Good oh, come shot from Vicky. Swing. Vicky landed the opening ones in that exchange. Like, that was a very good uppercut that missed from Cruz. The way they're getting out of the way of punches is not something we see in Robert Rowdy. No. They're doing it correctly. You also don't see them with their own gear. Yep. Like, that's why I said this to me. This could easily be... Like a 12 round fight. Yeah. They're fighting like it's a longer fight. Good right for Cruz. I guess this one's Cruz. Yes. A lot of circling from Cruz. Cruz trying to kind of stick and jab. Cruz's corner is better. They're both begging them to fight. Both yeah. Corners. Oh, good right for Cruz. Cruz really, really going low a lot. Trying to eat up the body. I'm interested to see the final round. Yeah. By the way, they've sort of gained respect for each other because Cruz went for the glove tap. She didn't really miss it. Yep. Yeah. You knew it was going to happen. I would say whoever wins, if, if someone wins this round definitively, it's theirs. Definitely. That's how it works here in Ruff and Rowdy. This crowd still, everyone on their feet. Prepping for the final round. Final round, you got to leave it out there. These are one of those fights that they're both. Deep breath. Both corners. Attending to their fighters here. So Dave. Looks like both of them are getting very technical advice as well. We just talked about how we didn't know how much thinking went on during the fight. But with these two, I think it's gonna be happening. I feel like that was an abnormally long in between rounds, too. Yeah, fuck it. Give them more time. They deserve it. All right, third round, final championship round, main event, last last round of the night. See if they go for broke here. This place will explode if someone makes contact. Yeah. Vicky is rushing forward. Oh, fighting. They are leaving it out there. Good right from Cruz. Bumblebee's coming. I give them both zero back down. Good shot. This is really good. In this third round, Vicky's fighting with more urgency. For sure. Yeah, she knows something. Here, comes, here Cruz. comes Cruz. Very even fight. A little face palm there from Vicky. Cruz didn't like it. Final ten. We gotta go. Oh, headbutt. Yeah. Oh, good right, Cruz. Cruz finishing with the flurry. And I think that's going to win her That fight. might have just stolen Cruz yep. the fight. I think that probably won huge, the fight. Huge, huge flurry at the end of it. She's fired up. Her corner's fired up. And, and I think I saw a shake of the head from Cruz, uh, Victoria Bumblebee that she knew. Excuse me, not Bumblebee Vicious. Yeah. Yeah. She knew she didn't have it. Yep. I think this one's going to go to Cruz. And honestly, I wouldn't hate running this back these exact same fights. These yeah. girls who almost need more rounds. Great job. Yes. Because a five-round fight would have been very interesting. Great night. Here we go. For the official I'm decision. Curious to see if they get along with these. Switches. Need the judges to flip their switches, okay. we're being told. We a split decision. A split decision. Crowd doesn't like that. The, I, don't, I think that's the fair. Yeah, it's very close fight. Fighting out of the red court. The red corner. Wow. So that one went to Vicky. And Dave, I'm not a matchmaker. I don't matchmake fights on the night of the fight. She, she, I mean, she got robbed. I would love to see this one ran back. She got robbed. That's hometown cooking. 
That's hometown. Which might actually do better for our health. Somebody check on Teddy Atlas. You know? That's the wrong call, though. Yeah. You know what? I'll I mean, watch she the fought fight her back. hard out. I, I, I don't want to call it a robbery just They're yet because too. the fight was so close. Yeah, it, it was. really was. I don't want to call it a robbery. They're handling it in the ring like I professionals, think, but right. I think the wrong person won. I, I think may, I mean, maybe we thought that there was two, bad, you know, judging me. that last 10 second flurry. From, I guess, uh, you know totally. what? I mean, Vicky had a great third round. I, I guess really if did. you look at it and go round one to Vicky, round two to Vicky, round three is clearly Cruz. Right. Here they are. So it's a great shot. That is a great shot. It is. Who knows? Left his friends. Well, let's get the interviews in there. Could have gone either way. These two could be the future Caleb. of Caleb. Yep. Yep, I'm here with Hard the loser. Our rounds. board, pretty much across the board, had you as the winner, especially with the last minute flurry of punches. Do you feel like you were robbed, some some hometown cooking? I mean, yeah, I definitely was, because she was tagging me, but I was hitting her with a lot harder and cleaner shots. Especially at the end, I could tell you guys were both really tired, but you seemed to be the one that had that final push. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I have more heart than the chick. I, I'm not going to knock her hustle. She's a good she's a good boxer, but personally, I still think I'm better, even regardless of what the judges say. Yeah, home proud. advantage, home ring advantage, it is what it is. I'd love to have her come to Allentown, face me one day, and we can get it there, and then you'll see how home advantage really works. There's definitely something to do with the home advantage. Let's go to the winner. All right, Kelp. Roan. Yes, I'm here with the winner. Uh, so that came down to pretty much the third round. What did you see happening there in the third round? Honestly, she's really tough, so I I wasn't expecting that. Yeah, She fought good. I respect anybody that steps in the ring, especially a female. I came in with a lot of hatred. She smacked my face yesterday, but I respect her. She showed a little flurry right at the end. Were you in any doubt right before the decision was made? I would say only yes, because third round does say a lot about a fight. Judges look at that a lot. But honestly, like, with the other rounds, I don't know. It was, it was close. What does this fight say about the power and the strength of women? There were some badass chicks. That's it. <laughs> and that's a fact. Back to you guys. All right, that was a great fight. Yeah. I'd actually fight. like to see him again. I'd like to uh, see him fight longer. But both very good fighters. Yeah. Both very good fighters. Very good fight. Robbie Fox here, rough and rowdy commentator and ringside correspondent. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, new videos every week, and go to watchrnr.com for the latest info on our upcoming events and how to find out how you could be the next fighter in the rough and rowdy ring.